A major blow to Stutzman County, a plan touted as one of the biggest construction projects in North Dakota, will not be moving forward. Instead of building a $3 billion Jamestown fertilizer plant, CHS is instead investing in existing facilities elsewhere. WDAY 6 reporter Catherine Ross has that story. Within several weeks, this nearly 700-acre plot was supposed to turn into a sprawling fertilizer plant. But after three years of planning and prep, surveying crews are packing it in. Pinching myself to wonder whether or not it's a nightmare. Agriculture Cooperative CHS was planning its biggest venture yet in Spiritwood. And nearby Jamestown was banking on the move's economic boom. But Wednesday, CHS announced it was backing out of the project and instead investing almost $3 billion in existing fertilizer plants. I'm not going to make light of it and say that no, it wasn't a big deal. It was a huge deal. It was uh, actually a dream for any economic development. The facility planned to go up right here could have hired up to 180 full-time employees, averaging a salary of $85,000. And the prospect of the huge corporation was attracting other business to the area. New housing and hotels have been springing up all around Jamestown. Now, some worry about developers pulling out. I'm concerned, very concerned that we're going to lose some of the enthusiasm, some of the excitement. In a statement, CHS thanked North Dakota officials and organizations for their cooperation. The company's president said the cost and risk associated with building a new facility simply outweigh its projected returns. Catherine Ross, WDAY 6 News. Spiritwood is already home to one of the biggest barley malting plants in North America and a $350 million energy park.